and would also spend a lot of time defending his decision to turn government informant and to turn rat. Being a rat, being a government witness, don't come on. You, you get locked up, you do what you gotta do. I don't come on more than there 50, 60 years right now. I know people who I talk to, they say, listen, this, this, that, another. Listen, you do what you got to do. I don't promote being a rat government witness. I promote do you. Because the code of the streets, that's where you're going to get hooked up at. But there is no code. Because what code is that you kill your mother, you your mother, because you're trying to get at him? I didn't live by that But unfortunately for him, Alpo wouldn't be able to experience freedom for too long because on October 31st, 2021, after attending a Halloween party, Alpo was shot six times while he was sitting in his truck. And some people who were around during this time feel like Wayne got played by Alpo, that he let an out of towner come to his city and turn him against the home team and it backfired bad. But according to Wayne's ex-wife, he went out like a real man he never read it, he never told, he never folded, and he still has his honor. They knew Alberto, there was a chance of him telling. You know, he wasn't from here. Y'all ain't come out, out the sandbox together. This bitch. Give or take, if it was Wayne that they caught first, Poe probably would still be out on the streets because Wayne is a true man to the game. Uh, he went out like a soldier. That's the whole thing. And in 2016, Wayne was moved from what many former inmates describe as hell on earth, that being ADX Florence, and he was sent to a prison in Washington state. He now goes by the name Nikosi Shakazulu L. He converted to Islam and now preaches a message of peace and positivity. His new message of peace is definitely a far cry from his bloody, murderous reign in the 80s and early 90s, but even to this day, the name Wayne Perry still rings out, and that's the life and times of the Michael Jordan of murder. Crazy story.